right, welcome back to Paradise Philippines. It's me, Aki, and we are here today at the Oak Ridge Business Park for the year two of the Visayas Art Fair. Here today are different displays of different kinds of arts here in Visayas. Name it, from sculptures to paintings, chalk arts. We are here and let's find out what this Visayas Fair is all about. So let's go and check it out. with Miss Fia, one of the organizers for the Visayas Art Fair. So, hello. Good evening, Miss Fia. How's your how's your day? How's your week so far? Mm, we only have 2 hours to see, but it's okay. It's worth it. Everyone is enjoying the event and it was a smooth and eventful and memorable um, event for all of us. Okay, got it. So, um how long did it take you guys to prepare for the entire Visayas Art Fair for this year? So for Visayas Art Fair, we actually started preparing last August for Bodega. Um, this was just last October. So we had one month of preparation for Bodega. But for Visayas Art Fair, um, that was from August. In regards to the event, how did Visayas Art Fair start? It started by Cebu Design Week. So this is an organization whose goal is to provide uh, different events and activities creatives and designers and artists in, in the local Cebu, Visayas and beyond. So for Visayas Art Fair, we are inviting different distinguished galleries and artists uh, and we are mainly focusing on visual arts. So there's a painting there and sculpture and watercolor, uh, different activities regarding visual arts. But here in Bodega, we are highlighting more on design, culture, um, Distinguished designers when it comes to furnishings, um, accessories, and home interiors. So yeah, these are from Cebu and from Sayas. Okay, this is something that's not really given a focus here in the Philippines, yeah. Dibale. Yeah. I even noticed that there were lots of artists here in the Philippines that are creating new kinds of arts. Like yeah. there were also artworks um, that were very, how do I say this, um, nature friendly. Which is awesome. The goal of Cebu Design Week is to create, cultivate, and connect. So we aim to make events that um, it's more on promotion of our artists and designers, collaboration, and education as well. Awesome. And to inspire and to create. Awesome. These guys are awesome. You guys should check this out. This is something new. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Thank you. You guys should check it out. Also happening right now in this Visayas Art Fair is a fashion show that's um, being held right now at the 12th floor of the Oak Ridge IT Business Building 3. So let's go check out what's inside or what's happening in this fashion show. Tonight, guys, is Sir Norley, one of the artists here in the Philippines that I've, you know, I've met, and it's a, it's a blessing because I found out lots of things about him. Like, for example, you can make 
um, awesome recyclable art from vinyls, from um, tapes, name it. So here with us tonight is Sir Norley. Hello, sir. Hello, good evening. So tell us about the type of art that you are creating. Okay, uh, in this uh, series of my painting, uh, I was creating uh, environmental uh, friendly. Uh, so I used the recyclable materials like uh, an old VHS and sometimes I use also a Betamax. <laughs> Anything na, na nawawala na from, from now. Diba? Yeah. Parang nandidispose na sila. So why not balik natin sila in the form of art? So I created this one as an idea using the old uh, materials pero in uh, happy things or sa pasayang ano so kaya ginawa ko yung spam so makikita mo yung kulay pero di mo mapapansin yung from the inside which is yun yung recyclable so yung process na to is came from the uh, traditional painting of animation the process is yun yung mahaba the process because uh, kuha ka ng VHS nakalasin mo siya tapos ipuform mo siya into box, ilalagay mo siya sa box tapos ipaint ka over the, the acrylic glass at the back so pabaliktad yung drawing so kailangan mo magpatuyo nung, oh, nung uh, acrylic para hindi siya sumama-sama so it's a, it's a long process I learned lots of stuff from you today and I, I'm so amazed there are lots of types of art that we didn't get into so it's it's kind of a blessing that we have this Visayas um, art fair because at least it's not just for the Visayan people but also people from Luzon or artists rather from Luzon are also coming here to show different types of art especially this one which is shocking for me because it's a recyclable art it helps out the community the nature itself thank you so much thank sir you thank you the Visayas Art Fair here in Oak Ridge Business Park and tonight with me is Sir Hersley Casero and this is one of his paintings so let's ask Sir Hersley what are his paintings all about or the type of art that he's been doing for a couple of years now. Um, so right now I'm under Shelter Gallery this is our first time to be part of Visayas Art Fair and this special is exhibition is actually a collaboration with Faye Mandy there. Faye Mandy and Howard Wong uh, they're the one who own um, Shelter Gallery and right now um, our pieces they're very dreamy and whimsical but we cannot even categorize what is them are my works or our works and which is I think that's good <laughs> because art is art uh, we, do, we don't want to belong to an ism and maybe we're doing um, our own kind of movement or art movement um, the kind of style that we're doing is actually maybe close to whimsical art or dreamy dreamy art. So the inspiration is actually very simple. I just want to celebrate life like, for example, this piece um, that you can see here. I want to remind everyone to be contented and to find their inner peace. That's simple, right? But also complicated sometimes. Yes. We want our audience like you and our viewers to tell their own story. In fact, the title of the piece is called Tell Me Your Story. So it's, it's, it's like a movie, it's an open-ended uh, piece where if I will tell you now how and what this piece is all about, it's like I'm just not giving the proper explanation. So we want the, the people to, you know, engage, indulge and savor our piece like it's their own. And so you want them to interpret yes. it the way that they want it? Yeah, it's so open for interpretation. It's like a story. And because my background is also, I love children's book and you know telling stories through my illustrations and images. Um, this piece is like um, one of our biggest collaborations so far with Faye Mandy. As you can see here, these are her line paintings because she loves these abstract lines, ripples and current, and the figure, the background, and all these sparkling fireflies that also uh, representation of the stars in the sky I put on the canvas. Those are my works. Um, 
So yeah, there's so much to say about this work, but I want and I want to let the viewers interpret their their own, you know, how they see the work. to sculptures, to modeling, to fashion shows, to tattoos, and everything else that is being displayed here at the Visayas Art Fair. This event is actually teaching us to kind of discover more things that are being displayed or the skills and the talents and the type of art that we Filipinos have in ourselves. So I guess this is it, the year two of the Visayas Art Fair. And also don't forget to join the next year's Visayas Art Fair. And I guess that was it. Please do follow us on our social media accounts, subscribe to our YouTube channel, click the notification bell button for more updates and the latest videos from Paradise Philippines. Once again, this is Aki and I'll see you on our next video. Thank you so much, y'all.